gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome. Today we are playing Father's Day. This is going to be the second and final part of our Father's Day playthrough. So let's jump right into it. Tell me to shh, you little bitch. Hmm, look at that. There's the puzzle pieces that I had. I, I, I thought I had three. I'll take that VHS. Oh yeah, let's throw this in the movie player. Let's check it out. Okay, let's do it. Five, four, three. Child who craves parental love becomes rejected because he is not like that. Needed to help Phil to find freedom. Calm down. Phil only got worse. Yeah. I was left alone. I decided that if we could not get real family back, then I could find a new one. And you sound like a psychopath. And I mean, you clearly are. I got home, I saw a baby, so could take care of him. I tried to convince Phil to go to Father's Day celebration on Sunday, saying that your life would change there, but he refused. Then I went there myself, wearing my best outfit. I wanted to amuse the children. And I met my father with the child. It was that boy from our house who treated him badly. He wasn't his real father. I made sure he was left alone and went over to him. His name was Peter. God damn it. It's just not right. It's just fucking not right. Your subconscious is more adequate than you. Ugh. You made your parents monsters. They killed Peter's parents because of you. Emma lost JJ because of you. Jesus. Came home after school. My mom was in a bad mood. I had to sit in the basement again. Jesus. This game's fucked. Jonathan, 4.27 a.m. Bill's diary, okay? Alright, I can't go upstairs anymore. So we're going outside. What the hell is that? A giant hook? Man, that would be a perfect clown murder weapon. Wouldn't it? Wouldn't it? 
Okay. Is that a grinder? Oh my god, it's a handheld grinder. Disc angle grinder is as dangerous. Jeez. Okay. So you're blocking my way, so we're going this way. We're gonna cut the lock and we're gonna go down into the fucking cellar. Where the other guy died. The disc is broken. Of course it is. It had just enough juice left to break that. I'm pretty high up here. Get a little bit together for forever. you. I gotta come all the way back down there now. <laughs> you doing this. Oh. Whoa, that was funny. <laughs> no, it wasn't. No, it wasn't. Hello, kid? Whoa, hey, kids. Aren't you here with your parents? <laughs> My name is Peter. I'm on holiday with Dad. Your dad lost you. He asked me to help you find a boy with dark hair whose name is Peter. Come on. I'll take you to him. Don't go, kid. <laughs> a few hours later. Holy shit. Whoa! Hey, kids. Hi, kids. It's me. <laughs> Need to feed my new friend. Oh, there's an egg cooked over here. Look at that. Let's give him that. And pizza. Perfect. Well, look at that. Pizza and egg, my favorite. <laughs> Hi, Mom. This is kind of creepy, isn't it? Took off my clown nose so I could eat. Nice. Oh, oh. Do I sleep on the couch? Of course I do. Ten years old named JJ. Police officers and volunteers were sent to search for him. Darkness comes out. Phil, 4.13 a.m. Bastard. Yeah, well, that's what happens when you're murdering people. I think children. Clown. Father's Day. Oh, man. Where's my video player? Guilty. Flashlight doesn't work. Perfect. Who needs it? Shh. Jeez. Is 
this. Shut up. Jesus, that was loud. I want to sit in a chair. So I'm going to sit down and watch this. <laughs> That's creepy as fuck. I like it. Don't leave alive. The battery on the video camera is dead. locked somewhere here he hides the key looks like there's a note in there Where the hell would he hide the key? Oh, huh. There we go, got it. clown okay I can open this ventilation grate with a screwdriver well where the hell do I get a screwdriver from So passageway behind the wall. Hey, you got a screwdriver for me? No? Oh shit. Oh, I am blind. Okay. It's fine, nothing to worry about.
Okay. Let me go on back through, turn that off, and then good to go. Good to go. Done. Easy. Easy money. And that's to knock down the wall. Perfect. A lot of back and forth. I don't really care for it. What am I doing going all the way up here? I'm here to smash the bricks. Wow. Oh shit. Okay. Creepy underground tunnel. I don't like it. Is this where he's going to bury all his bodies? Nasty. Yeah, there's human bones down there. Here you'll need a stepladder to climb. I can now open the box, which is in the pantry. Is that a pantry? It didn't look like one. It did not look like one. Nope, oh, that's not where I want to go. Step ladder, that's what I need. Take that. Box. Where the hell is that box? I don't remember. It's in here, maybe? Yeah, there we go. This is going to be the last puzzle piece in there. Oh no. Whatever that is. Okay, so I got the step ladder, so we'll go down here now. Get caught by Phil. Oh, fuck. Take the bell in the phone booth to save progress.
All right, clown. It's time to get fucked. a wheel. Okay. So I may have had to cheat a little bit and I kind of looked up what to do with this part. So hopefully I don't die. Hopefully I just beat it. I may or may not have spent about a half an hour dying to this guy already. So, you know, we're doing what we have to do to beat it and not take 10 years. Where are you gonna go there, clown? Little bastard. Hey, you going back that way? How about you walk up that way somewhere? So I can run past you, that'd be fantastic. from you. Catch you on the flip side, loser. Peace out. Alright. Yeah, give me that wrench, baby. Now where is he? He's way over there. Cool. Perfect. I'm gonna run fucking all the way around. To avoid this asshole. Eat shit. I wanna fix this slot machine. Hopefully this is all I had to do because I kind of uh stopped looking into it after I did a couple things so hopefully this is enough look at that I don't know what the hell we're going to get out of here what the heck is that it? yeah we did it the key now I can open the lock door in the basement it's time to go back Okay. So all we did was get a key from him, okay? See, like I said, I didn't watch the whole thing, so I wasn't 100% sure if there's going to be more. But it looks like that's all I needed. I just didn't know where to get the wrench. But we got it. Now we got to get the hell out of Dodge. Later, clown. You suck. Okay, now how do I get out of here? I don't remember. Gotta go towards the house, right? I don't remember how to do it. No bell to save. What the hell? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Holy fucking crap. I did not expect that at all. Jesus. Okay. That scared the crap out of me. That was terrible. Where the hell's my. Oh, there it is. Okay. I don't know why that was on the wall.
fucking scared now. What was this week and a half? What the hell is that thing? What the hell is that thing? Okay, he's gone. Okay, I'm gonna continue on then. I don't know if this is what I'm supposed to do, but I'm gonna do it. Creepy, creepy. This is, uh, this is what I need, yeah, 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 yeah. <clears throat> that was a good jump scare, holy crap. I think it was just because I wasn't expecting it, but man. Scared the fucking shit out of me. Terrible. Okay. Okay. I'll take that. Nice little crowbar. There's something in there and I don't like it. It's a secret door. Nice. I like secret doors. Oh shit. Hey man, calm down, I'll help you out. What the hell? Did the clown chain this dude up? Come on, little boy. I'll get you out of there. Um There we go. I knew the keys had to be close by. Okay, kid. We're getting you out of here, bud. <clears throat> I found the boy, Peter. He was alone in that room. Peter told me that he was there with two more children. I couldn't find them. I couldn't find JJ. Phil hid the information about where he hid them. Maybe I should try again. I'm sure I can find them. Damn. This guy was kidnapping children? Fuck off. Piece of shit. Let's leave it for now. We are starting the next system startup. What the hell does that mean? Act 9. Some places never let, let go. Jeez, I can't read. Never let go. Alright, Phil. 3.27 a.m. That boy, his name was Peter. His name was Peter. Was special? What the hell? It would never hurt him. He was lonely like me. Okay. Are you starting to remember what you did? No, I'm not. I don't remember what I did. Did I do something? Child disappeared named JJ. Yep, I know that. Is it me or was it a clown? I don't know. Maybe I am the clown? Jesus Christ. This is getting creepier. I don't really care for it. And I also don't really know what I'm supposed to do now. Okay, all the doors are shut. My order has arrived. What the hell does that mean? Does that mean I gotta go outside? 
Man, I'm creeped out. I'm getting the chills. Jesus. What I'm doing is not real. There is no time machine, but where is reality in which everybody is happy? Jesus Christ. What the hell? Brought friends for him and brought a lot of toys and food. I wanted to be a real father to him. Jesus. So I kidnapped a kid? Show me where the children's bodies are hidden. Guilty. Man, I'm killing, kidnapping and killing children. Oh, fucking shit. Man. If I'm kidnapping children, I deserve this. Starting another reboot of the system. Damn. I had to fix it. I'll tell you everything. Defendant Phil Harris was sentenced to death by electric chair for the abduction and murder of two children. Fuck off, man. He moved the bodies many times trying to hide them. Eventually they were found on the territory of the house. Harris buried them in the place where the van was standing. The third child was saved. Fuck sakes. investigation, the pilot project Golden Egg was involved. Thanks to him, we got recognition from Harris. In the Golden Egg, we discovered that Phil Harris suffers from multiple personality disorders. His mind divided into two different people. I mean... That sounds like a serial killer. The depressed Phil who drew into himself thinking he could prevent the death of his family and the dominant personality of the clown who had not manifested himself since childhood. So he is the clown. Oh, man. I kind of called it. Since the clown controlled him in real life, I think that Phil helped Jonathan find the place where the children were hidden. couldn't fix his mistake, but he had to help those families. Damn, that's fucking intense shit. Wow. Good game. Good game. Two thumbs up. Father's Day. That was a cool game. I like that a lot. Wow. Anyways, guys, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this playthrough of Father's Day. If you haven't, like and subscribe. Comment down below if you have any ideas for any future games, and uh, we'll see you in the next one. Peace.